So meron akong dinevelop na bagong forma wow. arrangement ng three moment equation which is very useful. Ito 'yan. Sa three moment equation, if we consider span AB and BC two simultaneous or adjacent segments. So kaya tinawag na three moment equation, it will be the equation about or involving the three moments. MA, MB, MC. So, we know here that the multiplier of this, MA, L1, plus 2, MB, L1, plus L2, plus MC, just like MA, times L2, is equal to, if these are unyielding supports, So, the right side will be negative 6AA over L, L1 of the left span minus 6AA over L2 of the right span. AA is the moment of the area of the moment diagram about left. AA2 is the moment of the area of the moment diagram of simple beam about the right. Now, if the load is uniform, if it is uniformly loaded and throughout the span, this will reduce to W L cube over 3, over 4. So, what we will have will be MA L1 plus 2 MB L1 plus L2 plus MC L2 is equal to minus W1 L1 cube over 4. While this one is minus W2 L2 cube over 4. WL cube over 4. Now, this will even be simpler if L1 equals L2. Look here. If L1 is equal to L2 is equal to L. So, what we will have is this is L, 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 L. If we divide everything by L, what we will have here will be M1 minus or plus L plus L 2L times 2. So this is 4 MB. Since we already divided by L, L is cancelled plus MC is equal to Let me factor out the negative. So, L cube over L is L squared. L cube over L is L squared. So, this becomes W1 plus W2 if we already factored out the negative. W1 plus W2 L squared over 4. Right? Correct. Or I can say that to be W1 plus W2 over 2 times L squared over 2. Right? So I factored out the negative W1 plus W2 L squared because L cubed over L. So, over 4 is over 2 over 2. That is over 4. My point is this. This becomes minus. This is W average L squared over 2. We are very familiar with this form. This is the moment of a uniform load about its end. W L squared over 2. If the W left and right are not equal, you just use the W average. So we just have 
141 WL squared over 2. You get it? You follow? Let me apply this Padilla's form of 3 moment equation. Let's have this one. In this particular problem in situation 10, we are asked to find the maximum reaction at point B. This is A. This is A. This is B. This is C. Support D. Support E. We want in problem number 28 to find maximum RB. So if you want the maximum RB, you have to arrange the live load in order to produce RB max. So to produce maximum RB max, so the dead load will be throughout all the spans. And take note that to produce RB, we load the adjacent span or adjacent to B with the full live load of 19. It's given. No load on the next span, then there will be another load for the following span. This loading will produce maximum RB and maximum shear at B. So that is the question in number 29. You want, we want B, VB max. So how are we going to solve this? So let us write here the three moment equation. So for the three moment equation, let us consider span A, B, and B, C. This one. Now, it means it will involve M, A, M, B, and M, C. So our coefficient will be 1 for 1. So this will be 4. Right? All you need to do is write the three equations, then put a coefficient of 4 on the middle moment. Is equal to negative W average in as much as the W here and W here are equal. So the W average is mismo ito. 15 plus 19, that would be 34 L squared, your L is 4 over 2. WL squared over 2. This will be our equation 1. But we know that A is external hinge support. MA is 0. So I have here an equation between MB and MC. Let me go to span B, C, D. The next span, this one. So this time, this is 15 plus 19, 34, and this is 15. The average of 34 and 15, 34 plus 15 over 2 is going to be equal to, this is 49 divided by 2, 24.5 kilonewton per meter. So this is your W average. So it will now involve moment B, moment C, moment D. So MB, MC, MD. 1, 4, 1. Equals. Wag ko na isulat yung 1, ha? Equals. Minus WL squared over 2. The W average of these two is 24.5. So 24.5 L squared, 4 squared over 2. Okay? This is equation 2. Now, considering span, the next adjacent span is C, D. C, D, E. So, considering C, D, E, you'll have moment at C, moment sa D, and moment at E. And the middle moment has a coefficient of 4 is equal to WL squared over 2, negative. 
the average of this and this, 15 and 34 is 24.5. So, 24.5 L squared over, over 2. But, moment at E, since this is an external roller support, ME is 0. So, this is equation number 3. I have three equations in terms of MB, MC, MD. You get it? So, three equations, three unknowns. Solve this in your calculator using mode 5-2. Input the, the coefficients of MB, MC, and MD. 4, 1, 0, and this. 1, 4, 1, and this. 0, 1, 4, and this, you'll get the moment at B, the moment at C, and the moment at D. So therefore, using your calculator, you will get here MB equals minus 62.36, MC equals minus 22.57, and MD is going to be minus 43.36. As you can see, it's simple with the Padilla's modified three-moment equation, provided our lengths are equal. If they are not, then we go for this one in the form of W L cube over 4. You follow? You get it? Okay, let me continue. How do we now solve RB? If this is RA and this is RB, if we take free body diagram left of B, so FBD left of B, taking the moment at point B, Considering the forces on the left, it is RA times 4 minus the moment due to this uniform load, 15 plus 19, that is 34. The moment due to this about B, that is downward moment, negative. Negative WL squared over 2 minus 34 times 4 squared over 2. But what is MB? Your MB, as we solved it, is negative 62.36. So, computing RA, RA is this plus this divided by 4. We will be able to get RA. So, solving this with our calculator, our RA is going to be equal to 52.41. Kilonewtons. So knowing now RA to be 52.41, we just had solved this. Now this time, let us take FBD left of C. So considering that FBD left of C, we now take the moment this time at point C. It will be RA times 8, 52.41 times 8, plus RB times the moment arm of RB about C, 4 meters, minus the moment due to this uniform load of 34 about C. So that is WL squared over 2 the L of the length of our uniform load is 8 meters. So, minus 34 times 8 squared over 2. But what is the moment at C? The moment at C, at, as we solve it, is negative 22.57. So, this is one equation in terms of RB. Input this in your calculator and solve your RB. RB is going to be equal to 
54 kilonewtons. This is your RB max. Nasundan? Nakuha. So yung mga hindi pa nakaka-enroll sa coaching program natin, humabol po kayo. Almost 50% po ng lumabas sa design na ulit. What? Kaya ini-encourage ko kayo na mag-attend po ng final coaching natin. Kesa naman po, magsisi tayo, huli na. Sayang po. So, aasahan ko po kayo na magkikita-kita tayo sa final coaching. Pwede pa po kayong humabol. Nagsisimula pa lang. Ang link nga po pala ay nandyan sa baba po. I-click nyo lang yung enroll. Okay?